what is quantum coherence? Quantum coherence is the idea of multiple things working together as one. And this provides the vibratory background for quantum phenomenon to happen in a living system. Some of the earliest quantum biological evidence came out of UC Berkeley, and it was the research of Graham Fleming and Greg Engel. And what they were doing was they were researching how a photon of light gets through a photosynthetic bacterium, a little microbe, and how it gets to the photoreactive center for photosynthesis to occur. And what they found was that this photon of light, this quantum particle, it takes multiple paths, it uses superposition, it quantum entangles, it uses quantum tunneling. But what really caught my eye, what got me so excited about quantum biology 20 years ago and keeps me so excited to this day is the idea that the thylakoid proteins in that photosynthetic bacteria vibrated in unison. They knew how to create this quantum beat, as those researchers called it, or quantum coherence, where this vibration kept that photon on its fastest path. To me, that exemplified this innate intelligence that is carried throughout living systems, plants, animals, our human body, this intelligence that allows for this incredible incredibly sophisticated and intricate interaction to happen in the body. It allows for quantum tunneling. It allows for quantum entanglement. It is the backdrop. And when this research first came out from UC Berkeley, these researchers were mocked. There's a story about Seth Lloyd. He is a prominent quantum biologist from MIT. At the time, he was looking at quantum phenomenon, a quantum physicist. And when he read this article, he laughed. And he and his colleagues laughed at the idea that quantum coherence could be happening in the living system. When they later looked at the research and how incredible the evidence was, they too turned their sights to researching and studying quantum biology in living systems. And that idea that quantum effects can't be happening, quantum mechanics can't be happening in a living system still exists today. It's one of the criticisms that many quantum biologists and quantum biological research faces. But that's the beauty of quantum coherence. It tells us that it is the chaos of life that allows for this sophistication to happen. And when we're looking at quantum coherence, the idea of a chaotic, noisy, wet living system allowing for quantum phenomenon has really been impossible because what quantum physicists do is they cool everything in the laboratory down below or near absolute zero where no life can exist. They shield it from any noise. They shield it from any vibration to keep those delicate quantum phenomenon in play so they can research it. And that's why quantum biology has faced such criticism because there was this initial hurdle. Well, that can't possibly be happening in a living system. It's way too noisy. It's way too chaotic. It's way too warm, way too wet. And what we're finding is it is that chaos of life that breeds a beautiful backdrop for these quantum phenomenon to happen. It is the the messiness. As humans, we, we are messy. We are complicated. And in that mess is the beauty of being a human. It is the beauty of what it means to be alive on this earth, to allow this incredible backdrop for quantum phenomenon to happen. This beautiful experience as a human that goes beyond a chemical mechanical experience. There's something more there. There is an innate intelligence that pervades the world around us, allowing for these incredible quantum phenomenon to happen in a living system, to allow us to achieve such 
exquisite existence. I mean, we're talking trillions and trillions of cells in our body, and each one of those cells is completing hundreds of thousands. Some researchers put it in the millions of tasks each second. That's impossible with the idea of the body as a machine. The idea of this innate intelligence, this coherence, coherence meaning two or more things acting as one, two people dancing the tango or multiple water molecules forming a wave that travels the ocean. That intelligence allows for quantum phenomenon to happen. And that is the beautiful backdrop of life. That is the backdrop of being a human. Our complicated, messy lives allow for this beautiful coherence. And I am so excited to be offering my quantum coherence kit. I've been working with Des Bio. They're an incredible homeopathic company. They still adhere to the traditional succussion method of homeopathy. They don't do digital imprinting, which can be wonderful, but they do the whole essence. And we've come up with some incredible homeopathic remedies to help foster emotional coherence, to help foster the body as an antenna, to act in coherence and receive this valuable frequency information that is all around us, as well as a supplement to help build that water within us, that structured easy water that acts as a amplifier and a receiver of this frequency information, building this quantum coherence within us. I love the the idea of quantum coherence. To me, it's a beautiful example of this invisible blueprint, this source energy, God energy, divine intelligence that pervades everything in life around us that we don't often understand and maybe we might never fully understand. But it gives us an idea of what it means to be human and how incredible this lifetime and this existence truly is. Thank you so much for watching and please stay tuned for more.